Hi, welcome to Awkward Amster. Today I'll be viewing this Yammer LED desk lamp. First thing I'd like to point out is it's not plugged in. It's got a built-in battery. The battery capacity is about 2,000 milliamps. The unit is very light, so I suspect it's probably just two AA batteries or three AAA batteries in here. Everything is touch sensitive. Let me just angle this better. Power button's right there. Turn back on. Here, I can change the color temperatures. There's five different color temperatures. And I can also adjust the brightness. When it's battery powered, I don't run it on the highest brightness because then I can only get a couple hours use out of it. Let me plug it in here for a sec. It came with a micro USB cable, but I'm just using mine. And once it's plugged in, the light becomes slightly brighter. The light in the room is just coming from outside. And if I turn it on, here's the brightest setting. Here's the lowest. I set it back to the middle. And just set it to a, like a more warmer temperature. The other two buttons up here are 30 minute sleep timer or the one hour one. And once it reaches that timer, the unit will automatically shut off. On the back, there's also a USB type A port, so I can plug in other USB cables to charge like my iPhone or my Samsung devices. Here is the manual that came with it. It's very straightforward. It goes over the life of the bulb, 5,000 hours. And here's the specs for it, whole item. This part, I can turn all the way down. Here's the highest angle. So it's almost basically 180. Now for this base over here, I can only turn it 80 degrees either direction. Not, not 90, just 80 degrees. And what I found is that with this, it's very stiff to turn. I'm not sure why they made it that way, but gotta put probably maybe more than five pound force to turn this. Move the power here for a sec. The other thing is on the bottom, it's a like a felt type of cover. So it's not going to scratch the desk. This unit was provided for review, but with what I've shown, there's really no cons. Consistent color temperature, no flickering. It's great that I can change the color temperatures. There's a sleep, there's a built-in USB type A, it could be battery powered or plugged in if I want to. And they're not even using any proprietary cable like some of the other ones. It's just a micro USB. Just anyone has micro USBs. Now, also with the battery life, if I'm not using the highest, I can get a day's use out of it. But if I set it to the highest, just a couple of hours. Overall, I like this a lot. It's under $25. I'll place the link to the sign below. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Walker Hamster. Bye.